This has been, honestly, a roller coaster of emotions and one of the craziest days in Flames history. I mean, it starts off awful with the news that Jacob Pelletier is going to be out indefinitely and that his shoulder requires surgery from an injury suffered a couple of days ago against the Kraken. This just sucks for a kid who is most likely going to make the opening lineup and in my mind was going to have a real breakout season. Hopefully he can have a speedy but healthy recovery, come back pretty soon and still have a breakout season. And a lot of Flames fans were also kind of cringing by the numbers reported by Elliot Friedman last night that Backlund might be signing his extension in the neighborhood of $5.5 million for three years and he's already got one year left on his contract. So four more years of Backlund who's already in his late 30s but then, bam, out of nowhere, he re-signs for two years, $4.5 million. And all of a sudden, it's like, wow, that's actually a great contract for the Calgary Flames. Craig Conroy did awesome here, and that could only mean one thing. Captain Calgary, the only guy who's played with Jerome McGinley and Mark Giordano, the previous two captains, and the guy that most of Flames Nation has been clamoring for to become the captain for years now, ever since Giordano got taken by Seattle gets named as the captain with his awesome new extension, which he definitely took a discount in. And what a roller coaster this whole Backlund thing. I mean, from Sarah Volley saying that Backlund was most likely not going to re-sign in Calgary, to then the Colorado Avalanche trade rumors, to now this, it's just been a roller coaster here. And you mix that with the terrible news for Pelche, it's just, what do we even feel, Flames fans? And look, I know this happened earlier on in the day, but I wanted to save it for last because I think it's by far the most important. You could see Conroy tearing up about it in the press conference for Backland. I mean, Snowy's strong, and I totally agree with Lamest fans who are saying hashtag put snow in the rafters. I think that needs to happen, and he's still fighting, and his wife sent out a heart-wrenching statement there. And uh, I mean, again... All he we can do and all he can do is keep fighting like he has been for the past multiple years. This guy is a hero and an inspiration. All I can say is, Snowy Strong.